You're watching Shoot Your Shot TV, and today we have the AJK01 Low. These are the AJK01 Low in the black and red colorway. But before we jump into that, we want to give a huge shout out to the good folks over at 1985 Gallery for letting us get another early look at the KO Lows. And here they are, black and red, mostly canvas upper for the tongue. You have a canvas tongue with a nylon tongue tag with the red Nike swoosh. They come with flat black laces pre-laced in, but they also come with an extra set of red laces if you wanted to switch them out. For the eyelets on the side panels right here, they're metallic eyelets. Taking us down to the toe box, you have more canvas material in red, and then you have black canvas surrounding that. On the side panels, you just have more canvas overlays in black, and then you have the synthetic leather Nike swoosh in red. Taking us to the back of the heel, you do have that classic Wings logo embroidered in black, and it says AJKO, and then you have more canvas overlays on the back of the heel cup. Taking us to the midsole, you have that classic AJKO midsole in white, and then for the outsole, you have that classic outsole with a little bit of curvature towards the back, kind of reminiscent of a Nike Vandal, and you have that Nike swoosh in the middle. The AJK01, originally released back in 1986, it was the knockoff version by Nike themselves because they realized other companies were making their own version of Jordan's. Jordan 1, trying to capitalize on its popularity. They featured a canvas-like upper opposed to the leather that came on the originals, and they were significantly cheaper. I'm talking prices were like $26.99 compared to the higher price of the original Jordan 1s. We didn't get low top versions of the AJKOs back then, but we're getting them now in 2023. We previously reviewed the Union Jordan 1 Low earlier this year, and we also reviewed the Shadow Jordan 1 AJKO Low as well. Make sure you check those out. And they've also released other colorways, like the black and white. They also released the white and university blue, similar to the Jordan 1 Kentucky High. They're finally giving us the bread colorway. These release on August 23rd at most retailers, including sneakers. And if you're in the area, make sure you stop by 1985 Gallery to pick you up a pair. They retail at a price point of 120, which isn't bad at all. You've got a lot of value there. As far as sizing and comfort goes, we definitely go true to size in the AJK01 lows, and we definitely go true to size in the AJK01 highs, just for reference. The comfort, you can definitely feel the softness of the sock liner right here. It's very soft, very plush. You can feel a little bit of cushion in the heel and the forefoot. As far as style goes, Jordan 1 lows are more popular than ever thanks to collaborations with Travis Scott. Even Union did a collaboration for the AJKO low earlier this year. And if you missed out on the general release leather versions of the Jordan 1 low, you can pick up a pair of AJKO 1 lows to get that similar look. They'll do the job. They style well with anything else that you pair your regular Jordan 1 highs with. If you want to flex the ankle, Cool, you can. How do you guys feel about the AJK01 Low in the bread colorway? Is this something you're looking forward to picking up? Or are you going to hold out for the retro of the Jordan 1 Lows with the leather uppers? Let us know in the comments. We'd love to hear from you guys. And if you haven't already, be sure to like and subscribe. We appreciate all the support over here at Shoot Your Shot TV. But let's go ahead and try these on. Yeah. I never asked to be put on. I went and got it on my own. That's for sure, dog. I put up on ATV. Trailing ACGs, cause we outside. Never has to be put on. I went and got it on my own. That's for sure, dog. Might pull up on ATVs. Then hit the trailing ACGs, cause we outside. No conditions. I'm outside with it. I might go fishing, no, I do not hold feelings. I go off road if the road missing. You know that the flow different. Shooting shots while all these hoes go tending. I might go swimming if the girl. Let us know in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you guys. But let's go ahead and try these on. Subscribe. <laughs> For the top? What was it? No, 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 no. Redo it? Redo it, man. How do you guys feel about the AJK01 Low in the bread colorway? Are you going to pick these up? Or are you going to hold out for the retro of the leather version? Let us know! <laughs> if you enjoyed this review on the AJK01 Low, make sure you check out all our other Jordan 1 reviews right here. We have a bunch for you guys to enjoy. But also hit that like and subscribe, and we'll catch you guys on the next episode.